Hi there, I'm Rami from Ledger, and today I'm going to introduce you to dollar cost averaging. Some investors like to put big lump sums into the market all at once. Some like to put smaller amounts over time, like a certain portion of their paycheck every month. If you prefer the latter, whether you knew that strategy had a name or not, you've been doing what's called dollar cost averaging, or DCA. Similar to how a 401k or IRA in the USA is funded, DCA allows you to constantly purchase an asset over time. DCA is one of many different investment strategies that crypto traders use as a way to help smooth out the impact of market volatility by investing money slowly over time. If you find yourself worrying about timing the market correctly, or you want to build your portfolio without having to manually execute every transaction, then DCA might be a great addition to your Ledger Live portfolio. In this video, I'm going to cover how to set up DCA in the Ledger Live app. By the end of this tutorial, you will be able to automatically buy your preferred crypto in the amount and frequency you want, letting you set it and forget it. Today, I'm going to show how to set up recurring Bitcoin purchases in my Ledger Live portfolio. You'll need a mobile phone and a Ledger device. First, you will need to go to your Ledger Live app and tap the Buy button. From there, select your currency, your amount to spend, and what cryptocurrency you want to buy. We will use Bitcoin. Tap Continue. You will then be prompted to select a payment method and country. Then tap Find Eligible Providers. DCA in Ledger Live is currently supported through our partners, Mercurio and BTT Direct. Each provider has different minimum purchase requirements and may not support all payment methods. If you don't see Mercurio or BTC Direct as an option, Try selecting a different payment method or increasing your purchase amount until one becomes available. Today, we're going to set up DCA with Mercurio. After selecting Mercurio, you will be directed to it within the Ledger Live app. Tap the menu bar in the top right hand corner and select the Recurring Purchases option. If this is your first time using Mercurio, create an account following the on screen instructions. If you already have an account set up, Sign in and tap Set an Order. Next, confirm your currency type and amount that you wish to purchase today. Then, choose whether future purchases will be repeated weekly or monthly. You also have the ability to choose a specific day for future transactions, allowing you to buy on the schedule that works for you. Your wallet address will now automatically populate the box on screen. Tap Continue. Note, if you want to verify your address, we suggest that you have it copied somewhere or written down as reference before you continue. If verified, tap Continue. If this is your first time purchasing through Mercurio, you may have to perform identity verification depending on the laws in your region. You may also be eligible for Fast Track. We will use Fast Track for this tutorial. You will then be prompted to choose a payment method. Once you have all your information entered, Tap Pay to agree to the purchase subscription. Congratulations, you've now set up recurring purchases. Your first crypto DCA transaction will take place on the day you have set and reflect in your Ledger Live portfolio. However, it may take a few days to process depending on the network. If you want to see the details of your DCA subscription, you just need to repeat the previous steps. Select Buy in the Ledger Live app, select a currency, choose a payment method, then click Mercurio. After you are redirected, click on the menu button in the top right corner and select Recurring Payments. From here, you will be able to see your recurring purchase order and full transaction history. You can also cancel future orders at any time from this menu if your investment goals change. In this video, we covered dollar cost averaging and how to set up recurring crypto purchases with Mercurio. If you want to review a specific one, you can scroll through the chapters below. Thanks for watching this larger tutorial. Please subscribe to our channel and if you have any questions or comments, let us know. Till next time, stay secure.